This is WCPO 9 News. Thanks for joining us for WCPO 9 News. I'm Adrian Whitsett, and we have a look at some of today's top stories. An over the Rhine street eatery was smashed last night. Cincinnati police are still looking for the driver. It happened just outside Sundry and Vice a little after 1030 last night. A red pickup smashed into the patio and drove off. You see the damage, but no injuries were reported. Parents demand transparency from Forest Hills schools about a possible consolidation of Anderson and Turpin high schools. Parents say they're not being told how this merger would address things like overcrowding or the impact of the move on students and families. Superintendent Larry Hook sent a letter to parents saying he has not made any recommendations to the board about selling any school. And tonight, a beloved Loveland basketball coach will be honored by his school. Darnell Parker died earlier this year at the age of 44 after being diagnosed with cancer in 2020. He coached Loveland's girls basketball team for five years before he died. He was supposed to be the grand marshal for the school's homecoming parade tonight at 630. His wife, daughter and son will attend in his place. Jen. Temperatures are starting milder today. We already have the cloud cover, a southwest wind, and this is all because of a cold front that's passing. Now, it will technically bring in a small rain chance today, but not a rain guarantee, but we are still expecting highs today in the mid 70s. But this is what this front does. So it's definitely bringing in the clouds and around 8, 9, 10, 11. Yeah, we could see a few stray cells, but it is not going to be much for us. And then that will continue to move to the east. Really no rain chances should be left for later on this afternoon. So I wouldn't worry too much about rain, although if you wanted some free water for your lawn, yeah, Mother Nature is not delivering that. Tonight, though, we all end up kind of falling back down to the 50 degree mark, which is mild, but it will not be mild tomorrow afternoon. We are not repeating the mid 70s. We're only up to 60 tomorrow as that cooler air comes in. We'll have a little bit of a northwest breeze as well to make it feel cooler at times, too.